Hello there, guys and gals. The Welsh Hunter here with a very quick three-quarter slash kind of full achievement guide-ish. And thanks to the generally just sex goddedness that is Xbox and Bethesda teaming up, 20 Bethesda games have hit Game Pass, including Fallout 4 and Elder Scrolls V for the PC. Now, of course, this will only work on PC, so obviously just be aware of that. But basically, we're going to be getting 1,250 plus more GS in literally less than 10 minutes. Console commands, what an absolute turn on, eh? <laughs> also, sadly, the Season Pass does not come with the main game in Fallout, so if you're happy to spend f more or less 40 bloody pounds slash dollary dues on it, then you can unlock more quest-related achievements, but that is up to you, of course. Also, if you did want to finish the main game off in any of them, I'm also going to be putting in the console commands needed to help you, i.e. God Mode, Walk In and Flying Through Walls, etc, etc. So, let's get Fallout 4 out of the way first. And I have to apologise about the writing, <coughs> that usually it's green, and obviously it's dark. Vegas Pro just didn't fancy, no, didn't fancy doing it properly, but... Yeah, anyway, so, I have missed this bloody music so, <laughs> so much, so, so much. So, let's get on with it, shall we? So, obviously, what you're wanting to be doing is starting a new game, of course. And then what we can do, we can now press the T button to skip the first cutscene here. When it sort of loads up, anyway. Come in, come in. So, how's your days, guys, going, guys? Oh, there we go. Right, so when we see this bit, now we can skip. And as soon as we get to the point where we can change our character, i.e. always handsome Squidward, why wouldn't you do that? Then you need to press the apostrophe button, which is located at least for Fallout on the same key as the at button. And then once that is open, the console command comes up, and then you need to type in C-A-Q-S. So that's C-A-Q-S, all lower letter, really doesn't matter. But then, what that will do then is complete every single quest, but with so much going on, you may need to do it a couple of times in case of any crashes, or if you feel like it didn't unlock any more gamer score. So for me, I could only unlock 630 gamer score, and I know others, including the awesome Bills over at Achievement Land, managed to grab 700. So, you know, just keep trying, and like I said, if you've got the DLC for it as well, type the same code in, CAQS, and get the DLC-related story achievements too. 40 squids though, so ouchy about that. But we're now going to come onto this screen. Now what I would do is just leave it alone for a, you know, a minute or two. Just wait until it catches up with itself. Wait for it to stop crapping its pants really. That's that's basically what we're doing. And until it starts... Now you should hear achievements unlocking like crazy now. Like absolute nutballs. So and <laughs> so I'd, I'd wait really until the achievement just started to chill out a bit. Have a great time with it, wait until the achievements just chill out, and then just start smashing through the OKs right there, just to basically complete the game, and then go back to the main menu start. So, yeah, that's what I would do anyway. And like, But like I said, if it has crashed, or if something else has gone on, um, just do the exact same thing. Reload Fallout, go back into it, console command, apostrophe, C-A-Q-S, and just keep doing it until we get back to the main menu. And hopefully, you would have gotten a lot of decent achievements. Like I said, for me, it was 630 gamer score. I know Bills and others have managed to unlock 700. So just keep it going anyway. And if you feel like that's enough, well, happy days. But like I said, the console commands and everything I'm going to put um, on the video and in the description box below. And I'm going to do it at the end of the video. Uh, I'm... Yeah, apologies, probably seemed like I was uh, waffling on just a little bit there, but I just thought I'd get all the information out. So we're going to get a couple of couple of loading screens and everything, and then uh, you should head back to the main menu. So here we go then, on to Skyrim. Now it's exactly the same, basically we're just going to load it up. You can do it in the main menu if you want, and then press new game after. Or we can just press new game uh, now, and then just type in the console command once again. Now Skyrim, for me at least, was a lot more crashier. Um, I don't know if there is a lot more going on in the game or what, but it 
did seem to uh, crash a lot more for me. Um, but it's basically the same thing. So again, I know that Bales managed to unlock 800 gamer score from this one. Again, I only managed to unlock 670 by the time I gave up and couldn't be asked uh, carrying on. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep on trying, but basically you can get up to uh, 800 gamer score, which would always be nice. So you're looking, potentially, if you can get 700 from Fallout, 800 from Elder Scrolls, you're looking at 1500 gamer score, well, for nothing, basically, within 10 minutes. And again, the same as I'm doing for Fallout, as I'm doing for Skyrim. I'm going to put the console commands in, so you know exactly uh, what to type in. If you just want to quickly complete this game and get the full beans, i.e. God Mode, etc, etc. But it's the same thing. Console command, uh, this time it was under the escape button for me this time. Uh, the apostrophe. So open that up. C-A-Q-S, and a lot of stuff's going to start going, and we're going to see a lot of achievements begin to unlock. But again, like I said, this one was very crashy for me. Uh, but yeah, so just keep on going. Keep on trying until you feel like you've either got it all or that you just can't be asked anymore, which was <laughs> my issue. But there we go then, guys and gals. So you can have potentially anywhere between twelve to 1,500 gamer score for free for under 10 minutes. Thank you so, so much for watching, guys and gals. I, ho I hope this video has helped and that you enjoy your free 1,200 plus gamer score. Big shout out to all my supporters on Patreon, including TimG84 and Ch Chan Spange. Mate, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to learn how you actually pronounce that one. But anyway, thank you so much to everyone. I'll see you in the next one. Big love, guys and gals. Big love.